Now, this, of course, is that special moment uh, I was telling you about in the beginning with that picture of a very lovely uh, top rising female amateur golfer, uh, Naomi Wafula. She is in the house, apparently. Yes, uh, most of you are saying, ah, Tony, to let her go, I'm supu to mwone. Yes, I'm let her supu, mwone. I'm na mwone to mkikula na macho mkishia. Is on Jarazole Nigerian story a Kwanza Musifikiriata Sai. And of course, together, uh, they have, uh, she has come with uh, the managing director of Bet Lion. And you're wondering why, how Bet Lion and Golf and Naomi are related. That's why they're here. Naomi, thank you for making time. And congratulations uh, for featuring in the inaugural um, Magical Kenya Ladies Open. Uh, you. you interacted with some of the top golfers. Ulukona butterflies. Ukienda kwa You know, yeah, what you when you feel on your first tee when you're teeing off on Thursday? How was it? I'm sure I could have butterflies. <laughs> uh, yes, uh, on the first tee, I was a bit nervous. <laughs> yeah, but after I hit my driver, I wasn't yeah. nervous after that. I got the feel of it, and you know, I just saw like I should just play my game because mm -hmm. there's no need of if I compare myself now with them, I'll just spoil everything. Yeah, you will, yeah, you will yeah, spoil your so. game, you just play your own game. Uh, comparing, of course, you, we, you are ranked in the, in, in the world rankings, your interaction with these golfers, uh, I'm sure there's something you picked up from the likes of Henselit, from the likes of uh, Ingolstrom, Eugenia Ngumu, and these other uh, golfers from those 28 countries. How, 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 was, how was the interaction? I remember one gopher who looked like a pig and a pitcher. Of course, those pictures will come later. Utani yambi amu kuna usiano gani na? Ah, yeah, I did take a lot of pictures, mostly with Cheyenne Woods. Yes. I I did was I look up to her, because yeah. uh, she's very consistent when you look at her golf rankings, and uh, especially that she's the niece of Tiger Woods. Mm. And you know, you know, playing with these pros, I really learned a lot. It motivated me so much because okay. even when you look at them, they have so much drive in them. Very true. Yes. Uh, Spencer, yeah. uh, I mean, how how how, how did you two uh, learn to be friends? Uh, what, what happened? What did you see in Naomi uh, that you didn't see in other people? And uh, definitely, this relationship, uh, where is it headed to? Uh, I'm, I I met Naomi through someone like I was playing if you play in golf park I was playing club night yeah. on Tuesday on a Tuesday morning and then uh, so one of the games the football Okiri told me about her and given that personally I'm very passionate in sports uh, if, if, but as uh, a person and also as a company we are very passionate in de developing sports in all the jurisdictions we, we operate in and especially from ground up so she, she told me he told me about Naomi and then I had the story, and then obviously I went on Google and like, who, who is this guy that everyone is talking about? So I read her story there. So I picked up my phone, I called her, and told her like, I've heard about you. Uh, let's see what we can do together. So obviously I called her. First, she started off as an employee, because as I said, we wanted to, her to get going, to get her back on her feet, because she was in Kitale then. Yes. And then, slowly by slowly, she went, she, she, she went back to golf, because we had to make sure that her, the work schedule and the golf don't, yeah, don't come in conflict. and uh, don't, don't conflict. Yes. So she started going back and uh, uh, I'm, I'm proud of her for how far she's, she started to come back with this, to the sport given that I don't know for how, how long she was out yes. of the sport. But she has slowly gone back playing the safari tour with the men, uh, with the magical Kenya Open that she played. And, uh, and her ambitions to stand pro, she's quite young. Uh, she, uh, all, uh, it's and doing something different in sport, making money through sport in a different in different way. Because that's how she makes her money. We got her in because she's a sports person. That's why she works for us and everything. So she just showed another angle that listen, you can still, you can make your money or or sport like. Oh, she's supposed to be in Mudaiga. If it's not, is it, is it cancelled? Yeah, think. It's, so, uh, they postponed it because of the rain. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yeah. Of yeah, but, uh, well, all I'm sure is that Naomi is, is going to be a household name. Uh, very soon, and uh, we are proud to be to help her get, get back. Uh, the, she carries Kenya on her back, uh, and I pray. With, I know it's a lot of waiting of expectations. Yeah, uh, Kenya, Africa, like, so the world is a is a place. Let let her have fun. Yeah, definitely with Bet Lion, <laughs> uh, of course, uh, it isn't that bad. Um, of course, you've mentioned uh, you are off. Naomi, you are off. I was reading your stories. Yes. that my colleagues were covering in Mombasa. You were off a bit over time. Kulikuwa na period that you really struggled in your golf and stuff like that because of so many things. 
as you tell us about that as well. Give us a history of Gop. Because most people think that uh, you, you must come from a very wealthy family or yeah. a very wealthy background yeah. to play golf. I'm sure you have a story that definitely can motivate someone who uh, really wants to play golf but don't have the resources. Yeah, uh, well, for me, uh, Rose Nariaka coached me yes. at a young age when I was around six years old. And that's how I ventured into golf. So I grew up with it. And by the time I was 12 years old, I was representing Kenya. And uh, along the line, I did take a long break for four years. This uh, long break, <laughs> can, you, can you explain the L-O-N-G? <laughs> what was it? Uh, oh, you want to summarize it? What uh, happened? Uh, those struggles are important. Everybody normally goes through struggles. Yes, uh, that's true. I had a downfall, so I had uh, a lot of personal issues to take care of. Yes. So I thought I might as well just keep off the golf for a while. Yeah, so gladly, Bet Lion came through, and that's how I'm back golfing now. Very true. Yes. Did you get? A t I've seen photos of you with uh, the first lady, uh, Margaret Kenyatta. Did you did you talk to her? Did you share about? Because of course, having uh, the first lady for this event for the ladies definitely those is very symbolic and must have been very motivational to you. Did yes. you talk to her? Did you get a moment to talk to to them? Um, or perhaps what did you tell them? Or what would you like to tell them? Because um, this show they are watching. Uh, yes, I got an uh, opportunity mm -hmm. to greet the first lady. Yes. Uh, that was a really nice privilege. Mm -hmm. And uh, then the Honorable Balala was doing the introduction. So he did most of the talking, introducing me to the first lady. Yes. And uh, she was really pleased. So we didn't talk more after that because she had to go to sign in. And, and yeah, and of course yeah. it was that particular <laughs> tournament. Yeah. Uh, Spencer, yeah. uh, definitely, uh, is golf one way you are using to, you know, to push a brand? Or what exactly? Is this just a one thing? Uh, I mean, just a one-off? No, I've supported. Why golf? I know you're mostly focused on football, but you've taken up this golf. Mesaidia Umrembo. Yeah, there's her, there's David Waku, who we also support. Yes. And then obviously there are a lot of com community, community football teams. But yeah, golf is one, one of the ways that we are supporting sport development. Because see, uh, we're in sport betting. So naturally people bet on a sport. So if we don't develop the sport, Soon they will run over, out of yeah. things to bet on and stuff. So we are, it's, it's not only it's, uh, just sub, uh, as growing a brand, but it's also growing an industry. Because that industry needs to be robust enough to be able to support mm -hmm. you. Because what will you be presenting? Exactly. <laughs> There's nothing to show. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Very true. Yeah. Uh, definitely. Um, uh, Wafula, Naomi, uh, yes. Golf Park is a place someone can really, these people who are afraid of golf, is a place that you can really start off is a place you can easily start off. Someone would like to hear it from you, because it's a place you can go, hire, get someone at a very cheap price to start off your career in sport. Uh, yes, uh, most of us started at Golf Park, specifically I started at Golf Park, and for guys out there who want to start, you know, they can just go ask for assistance at the pro shop and they'll get more information how they can get a coach, how they can get clubs, how they can be a member and start on the venture of golf. She's been modest. She's actually a very good tutor as well. <laughs> oh, so tell yeah. us about that, yeah, Spencer. Yeah. yeah, she's a very good tutor. You, you also play at uh, Golf Park, uh, yeah. Spencer. Yeah. The experience of Golf Park, because we want to encourage people to check up golf, so at least yes. now they can bet on golf, yeah. so at least they can be involved in golf activities also on the platform. Yeah, as I said, contrary to public opinion that golf is an expensive sport, I, I actually find it not as... No, I, when I started playing golf this year, yeah. uh, I'm, I'm, as 28, I'm now handicap 16. Ah, congratulations. Yeah. He Peter. went down just like that <laughs> so fast. <laughs> good, good I'm job. naturally a sports person <laughs> anyway. So, <laughs> like, go, I, one thing I advocate for, if you can, one, golf teaches you a lot. Even as a person, just not even your fitness and stuff, but it teaches you a lot of life skills. Like, you become more patient, yeah. you learn how to recover from losses. Because mm -hmm. these are things you can use in school. You can use at your workplace, you can use as a parent, you can use in your daily life. Mm -hmm. So golf teaches you a lot of life skills as, as, as well. And with places like, courses like Golf Park, where you don't need to pay a lot to learn the sport, I urge people to, to take up the sport. If you, are, if you are playing another sport, well and good, but if you are looking for a sport, let's play yeah, golf. Park too. Yeah. Naomi, um, <clears throat> who are these people, uh, besides Bert Lyon, who have been very impactful in your life, in your career? in your growth of golf. Who are these people you would like to appreciate? Now, uh, we appreciate Rosna Liaka. Do you know what I want to say? I want emphasize, of course, who is one of our pros, together with Bavisha, you know. Yes, yes, I have uh, good well-wishers out there who have supported me in various ways. Uh, first, I'd like to appreciate my mom for the support I get from her. Uh, she stood with me during the difficult times. 
Uh, second, I appreciate Rose Naliaka for venturing me in this game. And I appreciate all this. Uh, the guys who've supported me out there, the yeah. fans, you know. Yeah. yeah. And Golf Park as well. Golf Park I, is definitely one What are you not appreciating Golf Park? Because you see, Golf Park, you have to pay to use the range yeah, and do yeah, that. Yeah. Uh, we actually, he actually, actually does not pay to use their facilities. And we cannot thank them enough for giving us that, that platform. Very true. Yeah. Yeah. Golf Park, Asante Sana. Yeah. Uh, I'm a member at Golf Park, so uh, okay. definitely I know what Golf Park, the importance it ha they have, of course, in building golf in the country. Golf Park, good job. Na yeah, and, and of, uh, uh, of course, I can't forget to appreciate Bet Lion for yes. bringing me back in the game. Yes. When, when yes. did you guys uh, get involved with Bet Lion? You know, just as a police, you know, you know, you know, how did you start? Uh, and what are you doing for them? This is the fourth month now. Oh, really? It's yeah, okay. this is the fourth month Looks now. Looks like yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, the days are going really fast these days. Yes. And yes. currently, I'm working at the at the offices mm -hmm. as an agent. Oh, fantastic. Yes. You see, I mean, sports definitely can be a springboard to your career, to a place you can earn something. Naomi Wafula has just been playing golf. She has where she has reached where she is because of so many people. Rose Naliaga Golf Park. Take a look at now. Bet Lion and it. You can imagine the array of brands that we'll be seeing uh, Naomi Wafula carrying. Uh, we really appreciate, of course, what you're doing. Thank but you. keep on doing that. Thank, Thank you. you so much. Uh, it's, uh, it's an honor, of course, to have you. Uh, what are your next, uh, next tournaments? I'm going to go to your safari tour in Great River Valley. You can hear your calendar for next season in summary. What are your tournaments that you've lined up? You need to go international. pressure <laughs> on Yes, I was looking forward to participate in the safari tour that was to happen this weekend at Mukaiga, but unfortunately it was suspended because yes. of the rain. Yeah. So I'll just wait on that to see the next the, uh, next date they'll set it for. Yeah. And so I'll practice for that, the safari tours that are coming. I'll because you know that one gives me more challenge. Yes, yes. Yeah, so it makes me perform better. True. Yes. Uh, Spencer, in 30 yeah. seconds, uh, any golfing plans next season? She has to play international tournaments because yeah, you see the exposure. Yeah, like, as, as, it, like, as, oh, as oh. you wind up. Yeah, she has to play the international tournament, but she has to be ready for them. And that, she's just gone to the sports about four months ago. You are a golfer, two years coming back for, for, after four months. She needs to work on her game more. Get, she has now, we are getting a better equipment to help her with that and stuff like that. So I let her get exposure in the safari tour. Let her turn pro. I said, we, are, we have given her all the all she needs, financial equipment. Yes. It's up to her to decide how far she wants to go. It would be disappointing if she doesn't play in the major leagues. Very She'll good. be very disappointed, but I'm sure she'll not disappoint me. Managing director, <laughs> Bet Lion, and together, of course, with uh, Kenya's rising female amateur golfer, Naomi Wafula, who married, of course, recently participating in the magical Kenya Ladies Open. At the Baobab course in Vipingo, Kilifi County, bordering Mombasa County. Of course, thank you very much, uh, everybody who has enabled and assisted Naomi uh, Sante Sana Bet Lion for a good job. This is K24 Sports Hub. Thank you so much for, of course, uh, watching this show. You know, definitely, you don't need so much money to participate in what you love doing. Get on it, someone will pick you up along the way. My name is Tony Kolanda. Good afternoon. <laughs>